What if I told you that every choice you've ever made was never really yours? Because science itself now suggests that free will may not exist at all. In this video, we'll uncover what science really reveals about free will and why the choices you thought were yours may have been decided long before you made them. In 2007, scientists from Israel discovered nature behaving as though the future had already been decided. To understand their study, we first need to bring back the famous double slit experiment. Light has a strange secret. When it isn't being watched, it spreads out like waves, creating what's called an interference pattern. But the moment it's observed, that wave collapses into solid particles called photons, as if reality itself changes the instant you look at it. This is exactly what the famous double slit experiment proved. Now, this time, scientists tried something different. They let the particles of light pass through the slits and only afterwards decided whether to observe them or not. Now, at the start, no one was watching, so naturally the photons should have spread like waves, creating the interference pattern. But here's the impossible part. Their form seemed to change depending on the scientists' later decision. A decision the scientists themselves didn't even know yet. As if the particles already knew what scientists would do, as if our choices were never really ours to begin with. But strangely, this illusion of choice isn't only written in particles, it shows inside us too. In 1980, neuroscientist Benjamin Libet discovered something unsettling. Your brain makes decisions before you even know you've made them. In Libet's experiment, participants were seated in front of a clock. They were asked to perform a simple action, like flexing the wrist or pressing a button whenever they felt the urge to do so. They were then asked to note the clock's position at the moment they became aware of that urge. Meanwhile, their brain activity was recorded with an EEG a device that tracks the moment the brain begins preparing for movement. Now, results were shocking. Libet found that brain prepared for movement half a second before the volunteers felt they had chosen to act. In other words, the choice had already been made long before they became aware of making it, as if the conscious mind is not the author of our actions, but merely a witness watching decisions unfold that were written somewhere else. But that was only the beginning. More recent studies would reveal something even more disturbing. The further science advances, the more free will looks nothing more than a comforting lie. In 2008, scientists at Max Planck Institute in Germany used fMRI scans to dig even deeper into the question of free will. This time, volunteers were asked to press one of two buttons, left or right, whenever the impulse struck. As they made their choices, the scanners monitored their brain activity in real time. And what researchers found was even more striking. The scanners could predict which button participants would press, not half a second early, like in Libet's experiment, but up to 10 seconds before they knew it themselves. 10 whole seconds, a lifetime in neuroscience. As if the mind was built not to control our actions, but create the feeling of control, which leaves an unsettling question. If not you, then who or what is really making your decisions? Now, I'm really curious what you think about this, so let me know in the comments below. But it's not only experiments that point to this illusion. 
You see, Albert Einstein believed not only that free will was an illusion, but time itself. That the past, present and future all exist at once in what's called the block universe. And if he was right, then our future is already there, predetermined, waiting to be unfolded, like a movie where we play the main characters. And if that's true, then maybe our lives aren't just random accidents of biology. Maybe the structure of time itself hints at something deeper. An idea echoed in ancient traditions for thousands of years. That we play our role here on Earth to learn, to grow wiser and richer in experience until the movie ends and we wake up at the source to return again, to learn more, until one day we're ready to transcend and never return again. And if all of this was always meant to happen, then maybe even you being here may be no accident. So, what do you think? Is free will real or is it just an illusion created by our mind? Let me know in the comments down below. I'm super curious to hear what you think. And if you like this video, then please make sure to like it, subscribe to the channel and watch this one next. It may change the way you see reality forever. So be careful. I'll see you there.